Good morning, everyone. I hope you all had a great weekend. Why don't you guys turn to your partners so you guys can be a group of three and tell each other what you did this weekend. Okay, I'll give you a few minutes. I have a birthday okay. puppy. Fun. I turned I had Menudo. My mom made me see that dish. I spent time with my families. Just that. All right, let's come back together. Good. Jaime, will you tell me what Cleo did? Cleo, she went to her grandparents' house. Her grandparents? What did she do at her grandparents' house? She said she just had fun. Just had fun. That's awesome. I'm glad you had fun. Mackenzie, will you tell me what Shandy did? She had fun with her family. Her family. That's awesome. Family time is always the best. Shannon, what did Nick do? Nick played with his puppy. His puppy. And what's his puppy's name? He didn't tell me his puppy. He didn't tell you? Okay. Well, maybe you guys can talk about that later. <laughs> All right. Let's get into the lesson. So, um, in the past years, you guys have learned about basic addition. And recently, we've been talking about, like, the grouping of like numbers. And so, like, if we were to group two together, let's say we grouped it four times. So, two plus two plus two plus two. What does that equal? Does anybody know? Eight. Can you raise your hand? Good. And Kenzie? Eight. Good. Thank you. Yeah, she's right. Hi, me? I'm kind of confused. Confused on how she got the answer? Yeah, I don't know how she did. Okay, so we're going to group twos together, okay? So two plus two is what? It's four. Okay, so now let's do another one. Two plus two again? It's four. So four plus four? It's eight. Yeah, that's how she got it. Oh, okay. Did you get it? Yeah. Four groups of two? Good, okay. So today we're going to learn about multiplication, which is a faster way of grouping those numbers together. So we're going to do that by reading The Best of Times by Greg Tang. Okay? I'm not going to read the whole book to you because it's kind of long, but we're going to just read um, the twos, the threes, and the fives because we're focusing on mainly the twos and the fives today, okay? <clears throat> All right. So it says, two-step. Two is very fast and fun. Quickly double and you're done. What's that you say? Be more precise. Okay, then just add it twice. What is two times two? So two groups of two. Hi, me. Good, good job. All right, this is a tougher one. Ready? What is two times eight? So two groups of eight. Good, I see everyone counting. Does anybody know? Shannon, 16. Good job! Yes, that's exactly right. All right, let's go on to the threes. Three sum. There is an easy, there, three is as easy as it can be. If you triple what you see. In other words, just add it thrice. This simply is more than twice. What is three times three? So if you have one group of three, two groups of three, and one more group of three. How many is that? Three plus three plus three. Nick. No. Yes, exactly. You guys are getting it. I'm impressed. All right, let's go on to the fives. <clears throat> All right, it says five alive. Five will yield the right amount. If by fives, you always count. Or else just multiply by ten. Half will get you there again. All right, so I want to look at these picture, this picture right here. So you see how there's one group of five here, and then another group of five over here. So if we have two groups of five, how many do we have? Yes, ten. Exactly. Good job. You guys are doing awesome. So we have two groups of five, which equals ten. Awesome. All right. So I want to show you guys something really cool. So see right here is a fact table of our twos, and then over here is a fact table of our fives. So I'm going to give you guys those so that it will help you when you're practicing tonight at home, okay? And those out to you. <clears throat> All right. And those will also help you on our worksheet that we have later, okay? All right, so now that we know more about multiplication, we are going to just dive in specifically on the twos and the fives, okay? Are you guys ready to try some? Who's excited? Raise your hand if you're excited. Woo! 
good. Okay. So let's practice. Um, first, we're going to start with two times five. Does anybody know what that is? Hi, me. Is it seven? Seven. Okay, he said seven. So that's addition. We've learned that in the past. Good job on that. But today we're going to do multiplication. So I want to show you guys something for a second. So when we have a multiplication sign, it kind of looks like an X, okay? And so instead of using the X, we're going to replace it with of. So it's going to read two groups of five, okay? So we're going to have two groups of five. So look at the worksheet. We have one group, another group. And inside those two groups are five stars. So if we have two groups of five, how many stars are there? Cleo? Ten. Yes, exactly right. Good. And how did you know that? Because there's ten stars. Good. Exactly. All right. This one is going to be a little bit more challenging. Okay? Are you guys ready? Ready for the challenge? Okay. So we have five times five. Four. First, who can read it to me, replacing the X with an of? Who can read that? Kenzie. Five groups of four. Good, exactly. Now, who can tell me the answer? Yes. 20. Good job. And how did you know that? Um, I remember 2 times 5, which was 10, so I added 2 more to the 4, so it comes out. There's five groups of four. So yeah, exactly. And so that's exactly what he just said. There's five groups of four. And so if you look, we have one, two, three, four, five groups, and four stars in each of our groups, which equals 20. That's exactly right. Good job, guys. So you guys have done a great job today. Um, now we are going to pass out our, pass out your worksheet. Does anybody have any questions? Let's start with that. Any questions? No? No question. Yes? What are we going to do tomorrow? What are we going to do tomorrow? You're going to have to find that out tomorrow. Okay. Got to come to school. Okay. So let's pass out the worksheet. Um, you guys can work um, individually or with partners or with a group of three. Um, but while you're working on your worksheet, if you have any questions at all, then you guys just need to ask me, okay? Make sure everybody's working. Good job. Cleo's even making her groups over here. She's making pictures. Who else is going to so make some pictures? Are you? Yes. <gasps> Good job. This way. Yes. Mine was Good job. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's All right, guys, if you didn't finish your workout that, or your worksheet, that's going to be your homework for tonight, but we're going to move on to science, okay? All right. <coughs>